interesting short that is packed with double meanings. At first, the music is sentimental with the sound of dial-up, and we see an innocent picture of a dog, but then we're taken uh, to a more risque dog who is masked. And the film, to me, really seems to be about this line of visibility and invisibility through the meanings of this dog as something or someone who is um, hypersexual and is... uh, being personified through being a dog. And what I mean by hypersexual, I mean like the term of like someone is a dog and you know kind of that that has um, like a double meaning there. And I think one part that I found really compelling is in the beginning, the way that the dog is trying to find its identity and ends up becoming very formless and takes on these different shapes. And I think that ultimately highlights this narrative of being um like formless and full of the possibility of being shaped on or by the internet and also taking on different shapes and different um, identities in spaces where you feel like you can do that. At first I was pretty mesmerized just by the movement and the twisting. Um, It was uh, sort of mesmerizing to watch that and listen to the strange sounds and all of that. Um, It got weirder and weirder. I loved the unspoken humor in this film. A lot of parts were kind of funny. Um, There was very interesting music and sound effects that went on top of all of this. And then just the ending where it it says, you know, we all know what you are, who you are. Um, A very sinister ending. Um, It almost felt accusatory to us viewers. um, Like, we know what you're watching. this this dog stuff um so yeah very interesting film um it was very unique to watch a very unique uh, viewing experience the use of cgi is brilliantly done very clever computer clicks to build the tension you could really sense the main viewer going through thought processes of privacy and secrecy and the big reveal at the end was so dramatic i appreciated the synth soundtrack that builds the action and also the clever use of glitches and older modem sound, static and silence. Uh, They have this very cool animation. I like the colors, the old PC windows and errors and this internet connection sound effect. It was, those elements are quite interesting as well as the title. And then the ending was quite mysterious as well. You you don't know what, what happens after they discover these messages. It is very interesting. It did have a cool retro feel to it. The animation was interesting. I felt like it was kind of a message about how the internet is not private. So keep your own things to yourself because now everybody's going to know if it gets out there. So um, yeah, that's my take on it. But um, interesting take on the privacy side of it, I think, for the internet and how somebody uh, feels they can express themselves privately, but becomes not so private. I liked the graphics. I thought that that was a lot of fun. I think that the error message spam was very funny when you go to open up the porn thing and it ends up crashing your computer. Um, I think they did a really good job with the music. Yeah, 